Okay, so I checked it out, um, and uh, I did have to make a tiny uh, unbalanced correction. I, I, I just ground a little bit off of this pole here right in the middle. I mean, just a tiny amount. It was swinging just barely. I fixed that, and it sounds awesome. So uh, it's good to go. So uh, I've cleaned the comm off real good just so I can stick it in the box. And uh, usually what I do is I'll uh, you keep it from rusting, put a little something on the outside. Some guys use armature dye. You can get from Lucky Bob and other guys I think have some armature dye. Um, oftentimes I'll just use a Sharpie. And uh, this year I've been doing arms in a green color. So here I got my green Sharpie and I just, all the exposed metal on the outside, I just hit it with the Sharpie. So on all the poles, go around. And like I said, all this does is kind of, it, well, it helps me identify what year I did it because it's a green one. Um, last year I did some blues, I think. I think it was blue. Um, no, I take that back. It was yellow. It was blue the year before that. Anyway, so uh, there you go. Oops, I got some, took some off of my finger. Okay. So that's it. So this arm's ready to throw in the box and ready to build uh, into a car at some point, and uh, it's good to go. I hope that's uh, informative, and uh, anyway, that's how I do my dash arms. So, um, see you guys at the race.